Okay, what's up YouTubers again? So, thank the Maker, our God. I have a bit of a time, a bit of spare time to to produce this Bible reading Bible reading vid. Maybe add a bit of prayers, you know, since tomorrow will be another big day for me. And, uh, you know, I just don't see how my depression, suicidal thoughts, intrusive thoughts could get cured or healed. And I currently have, you know, no friends in China. And, you know, just a handful of, uh, you know, family members who are willing to, to nurse my wounds, you know. So anyway, without further ado, I'd like to um, you know, get myself more familiarized with the Bible, with God's words. So tonight, I like to read a few, you know, um, several chapters of the, you know, the book of Psalms. So, I believe la last time, I think I read unto somewhere, somewhere unto chapter. 17 or yeah somewhere on in two chapter 17 so I will begin with song chapter 18 yeah Psalm chapter 18 KJV to so the chief musician a song of David the servant of the Lord who spake unto the Lord the words of this song in the day that the Lord delivered him from the hands of all his enemies and from the hand of Saul and he said I will love thee, O Lord, my strength. The Lord is my rock and my fortress and my deliverer, my God, my strength, in whom I will trust, my buckler and the horn of my salvation and my high tower. I will call upon the Lord who is worthy to be praised. So shall I be saved from mine enemies. The sorrows of death compassed me and the floods of ungodly men made me afraid. The sorrows of hell compassed me about. The snares of death pre prevented me. In my distress, I called upon the Lord and cried unto my God. He heard my voice out of his temple, and my cry came before him, even into his ears. Then the, then the earth shook and trembled. The foundations also of the hills moved and were shaken, because he was worth. He was wroth. There, there went up a smoke out of his nostrils, and fire out of his mouth devoured. Coals were, were, kindled, were kindled by it. He bowed the heavens also, and came down. He bowed the heavens also, he bowed the heavens also, and came down. And darkness was under his feet. And he rode upon a, a cherub, a, a, a cherub and did fly ye he did fly upon the wings of the wind he made darkness his secret place his pavilion round about him were dark waters and thick clouds of the skies and at at the brightness at the brightness that was before him his thick clouds passed hailstones and coals of fire the Lord also thundered in the heavens, and the highest gave his voice, hailstones and coals of fire. Ye, he sent out his arrows, and scattered them, and scattered them, and he shot, he, he shot, he shot out lightnings, and this, and discomfited them, discomfited them. Then the, cha the channels of waters were seen, and the foundations of the world, the world were discovered at thy rebuke, O Lord. At the blast, at the blast, at the blast of the breath of thy nostrils, he sent from above. He took me. He drew me out of many waters. He de delivered me from my strong enemy, and from them which hated me, for they were too strong for me. They prevented me in the day of my calamity, but the Lord was my stay. He brought me forth also into a large place. He delivered me because he delighted in me. 
the Lord rewarded me according to my righteousness. According to the cleanness of my hands hath he recompensed, re, uh, ha, hath he recompensed me. For I, for I have kept the ways of the Lord, and have not wickedly departed from my God. For all his judgments were before me, and I did not put away his statutes, and his, I did not put away his, his um, um, statutes from me. I was also upright before him, and I kept myself from mine iniquity. Therefore hath the Lord rec um, recon um, recon rec rec recompensated or recompensed, recompensed me according to my righteousness, according to the cleanness of my hands in his eyesight. With the merciful, with the merciful thou wilt show thy merciful. With the merciful thou wilt show thyself merciful. With an upright man thou wilt show thyself upright. With the pure thou wilt, wilt show thyself pure. And with the fraud and with the forward thou wilt show thyself forward. For thou wilt save the afflicted people, but wilt bring down high looks. For thou wilt light my candle. The Lord my God will enlighten my darkness. For by thee I have run through a troop, and by my, by, by my God have I leaped over a wall. As for God, his way is perfect. The word of the Lord is tried. He is a buckler to all those, all those that trust in him. For who is God save the Lord, or who is a rock save our Lord, save our God? It is God that, that, <clears throat> that, that girdeth me with strength and maketh my way perfect. He maketh he maketh my feet like like hinds feet and and setteth me upon my high places. He teacheth my hands to war, so that a bow of steel is broken by my hand by my arms. Thou hast thou hast also given me the shield of thy salvation, and thy right hand hath holden me up, and thy gentleness hath me hath made me great thou hast enlarged my steps under me that my feet did not slip i have pursued mine enemies and overtaken them neither did i turn again till they were consumed i have wounded them that they were not able to rise that um, they know that they are fallen under my feet for thou hast girdled <clears throat> girded me with strength unto the battle thou hast subdued under me those that rose up against me thou hast also given me the necks of mine enemies that i might destroy them that hate me they cried but there was none to save them even unto the lord but he answered them not then did i beat them small as the dust before the wind i I did cast them out as the dirt in the streets. Thou hast delivered me from the, from the strivings of the people, and thou hast made me the head of the heathen. A people whom I have not known shall serve me. As soon as they hear, they hear of me, they shall obey me. The strangers shall submit themselves unto me. The strangers shall fade away and be afraid out of their close places the lord liveth and blessed be my rock and let the god of my salvation be ex <clears throat> exalted 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 it is god that avengeth me and sub subdueth subdueth the people under me he delivereth me from mine enemies he thou liftest Thou liftest me up above that rise up against me. Thou hast delivered me from the violent man. Therefore will I give thanks unto thee, O Lord, among the heathen, and sing praises unto thy name. Great deliverance, great deliverance giveth he to his king, and showeth mercy to his anointed, to David, and to his seed forevermore. Psalm chapter 9 to the chief musician, a son of David. 
the heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament and the firmament firmament showeth His handiwork. Day unto day uttereth speech, and night unto night showeth knowledge. There is no speech nor language where their voice is not heard. Their line is gone is gone out through all the earth, and their words to the end of the world. In them hath he set a tabernacle for the sun, which is as a bridge room, as a as a bright bridegroom bridegroom, coming out of his chamber, and rejoiceth as a strong man to run the race. His going forth, his going forth is from the end of the heaven, and his circuit unto the ends of it. And there is nothing hid from the heat thereof. The law, the law of the Lord is perfect, converting the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, making wise the simple. The statutes of the Lord are right, rejoicing the heart. The command, the commandment of the Lord is pure, enlightening the eyes. The fear of the Lord is clean, enduring for ever. The judgments of the Lord are true and righteous altogether. More to be desired are they than gold, ye, than much fine gold, sweeter also than honey and the honeycomb, and the honey, um, comb. Moreover, by them is thy servant warmed, and in keeping of them there is great reward. Who can who can un understand? His errors, cleanse thou me from secret faults. Keep back thy servant also from presumptuous sins. Let them not have dominion over me. Let not them have dominion over me. Then shall I be upright, and I shall be innocent from the great transgression. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my strength and my redeemer. Psalm chapter twenty, to the chief musician a psalm of David, the Lord hear thee in the day of trouble, the name of the God of Jacob defend thee, send thee help from the sanctuary and strengthen thee out of Zion, remember all thine offerings and accept thy burnt sacrifice, Selah, grant thee according to thine own heart and fulfill all thine counsel. We will rejoice in thy salvation, and in the name of our God we will set up our banners. The Lord fulfill all thy petitions. Now know I that the Lord saveth his anointed. He will hear him from his holy heaven with the saving strength of his right hand. Some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we will remember the name of the Lord our God. They are brought down and fallen, but we are risen and stand upright. Save, Lord, let the King hear us when we call. Psalm chapter twenty-one to the chief musician, a psalm of David. The King shall shall joy in thy strength, O Lord, and in thy salvation. How in thy salvation, how greatly shall he rejoice! Thou hast given him his heart's desire. And hast not withholden the request of his lips, Selah, for thou preventest him with the blessings of goodness. Thou settest a crown of pure gold on his head. He asked, he asked life of thee, and thou givest it him. Thou givest givest it him, even length of days, for ever and ever. His glory is great in thy salvation. Honor and majesty hast thou laid upon him. For thou hast made him most blessed for ever; thou hast made him exceeding glad with my countenance. For the king trusteth in the Lord, and through the mercy of the Most High he shall not be moved. Thy hands, thy hand shall find out all thine enemies; thy right hand shall find out those that hate thee. Thou shalt make them as a fiery oven in the time of thine anger. The Lord shall swallow them up in His wrath, and the fire shall devour them. Their fruit, their fruit, shall thou destroy from the earth, and their seed from among the children of men, for they in, in, <clears throat> intended evil against thee. They imagined a mischievous device which they are not able to perform. 
therefore shalt thou make them turn their back. When thou shalt make ready thine arrows upon thy streams against the face of them, be thou exalted, Lord, in thine own strength. So will we sing, we will sing and praise thy power. Song chapter 22. To the chief musician upon Ijeleth, Sharhar, a son of David, my God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? Why art thou so far from helping me and from the words of my roaring? My God, O oh my God, I cry in the daytime, but thou hearest not, and in the night season, and I am not silent, but thou art holy. O oh, thou that inhabitest in the praises of Israel, our fathers trusted in thee, they trusted, and thou didst deliver them. They cried unto thee, and were delivered. They trusted in thee, and were not confounded. But I am a worm, and no man, a reproach of men, and despised of the people. All these that see me laugh me to scorn. They shoot, they shoot out the lip. They shake their head, saying, He trusted on the Lord that he would deliver him. Let him deliver him, seeing he delighted in him. But thou art he that took me out of the womb. But thou art he that took me out of the womb. Thou did, thou did, thou didst, thou didst, thou didst make me hope when I was upon my mother's breasts. I was cast upon thee from the womb. Thou art my God from my mother's belly. Be not far from me, for trouble is near, for there is none to help. Many bulls have compassed me. Strong bulls of Bashan have beset me round. They graped, they gapped, they gapped upon me with their mouths. As a ravening and a roaring lion, I am poured out like water, and all my bones are out of joint. My heart is like wax, it is melted in the midst of my bows, of my bowels. My strength is dried up like a potter shred, like a pot shred, and my tongue cleaveth to my jaws, and thou hast brought me into the dust of death. For dogs have compassed me, the assembly of the wicked have enclosed me, they pierced my hands and my feet. I may tell all my bones, they look and stare upon me. Depart, they part my garments among them, and cast lots upon my vesture. Be, but be not thou far from me, O Lord, O my strength. Haste thee to help me. Deliver my soul from the sword, my darling from the power of the dog. Save me from the lion's mouth, for thou hast heard me from the horns of the unicorns. I will, de I will declare my, thy name unto my brethren. In the midst of the congregation will I praise thee. Yet that fear the Lord, praise him, all ye the seed of Jacob, glorify him and fear him, and ye the seed, all ye the seed of Israel, for he hath not despised nor abhorred the affliction of the afflicted, neither hath he hid his face from him, but when he cried unto him, he heard. My praise shall be of thee in the great congregation. I will pay my vows before they that before them that Fear him, the meek shall eat and be satisfied. They shall praise the Lord that seek him. Your heart shall live forever. All the ends of the world shall remember and turn unto the Lord. And all the kindreds of the nations shall worship before thee. For the kingdom is the Lord's, and he is the governor among the nations. And all that all they that be fat upon earth shall eat and worship. All they that go down to the dust shall bow before him, and none can keep alive his own soul. A seed shall reserve him, a seed shall serve him. It shall be accounted to the Lord for a generation. They shall come and shall declare his righteousness unto a people that shall be born, that he hath done this. Psalm 23, a Psalm of David. The Lord is my shepherd, 
I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the paths of the righteousness for his name's sake. Ye, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy, and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil. My cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Psalm chapter 24, a psalm of David. The earth is the Lord's, and the fullness thereof, the world, and they that dwell the well therein. For he hath founded, founded upon the seas, and established it upon the floods, who shall ascend into the hills of the Lord, or who shall stand in his holy place, he that hath clean hands and a pure heart, who hath not lifted up his soul unto vanity, nor, swar nor sworn deceitfully, he shall receive the blessing from the Lord and righteousness from the God of his salvation. This is the generation of them that seek him, that seek thy face. O Jacob's Selah, lift up your heads, ye O ye gates, and be ye lift up, ye everlasting doors, and the King of glory shall come in. Who is this King of glory? The Lord strong and mighty, the Lord mighty in battle. Lift up your heads, O ye gates, even lift them up, ye everlasting doors, and the King of glory shall come in. Who is, who is this King of glory? The Lord of hosts. He is the King of glory. Selah. Oh my God. So yeah, it certainly isn't easy to, you know, to walk in the Lord's paths. Jesus, the Lord's path. Do you think I should make a prayer? Yeah, let's begin. Dear Heavenly Father, and the Lord Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit, I thank you again for keeping my grandma and my aunt, my uncle, and my side during this time of severe tribulation and trouble and, and pestilence. I thank you that I still have access to the global internet. I thank you that, that you are still keeping me alive because you haven't yet cast me into the lake of fire or hell. So here I ask of you, if you could, heal my wounds, cure my depression and choose your thoughts, and suicidal thoughts and murderous intrusive thoughts and also set me free from my addiction to women's flesh and the image the images of them if you could or or if you couldn't at least at least bestow a decent and gorgeous spouse upon me in the future so that I won't spend my life, my entire life, in complete, in utter solitude. Um, and please guard my heart against intrusive thoughts of committing suicide, especially tomorrow while I am on the way to the hospital. Please soften the doctor's heart so that he can pres prescribe me something more effective with less side effects and also please keep please keep my grandma at my side for as long as you can please help me with my japanese language please help me with my my cognitive my um my degenerated cognitive abilities and um, because of that i have lost the fluency in speaking Japanese, also in speaking Mandarin Chinese, also in speaking English, 
on some occasions. It is just so terrifying that I might become, you know, um, a good for nothing dude. I don't want to become like a good for nothing dude. At least revitalize my spirit and body so that I can endure, endure to the end. Help me endure to the end. Help me endure to the end. And thanks again for granting me the time, the spare time and the spare energy to get myself more acquainted with your words. And also in the meantime, use me as an instru instrument to inspire those that are suffering, that are afflicted, especially single men, fatherless men, MGTOW men. Help me help my YouTube channel grow so that I can make a bit of more money to support myself. To support my grant to you know to 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 fund my my overseas travels etc thanks again and amen okay i don't know if making such prayer would suffice to soften the lord's heart if he could send cast me into the you know the lake of fire since I'm still, I still have been sinning, you know, even to today I've sinned, though not as much as I, I, I sinned last night. I just, you know, got tempted and, uh, you know, on Facebook, um, there was uh, apparently a, you know, a, 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 uh, a fake account or an and and you know uh, an account that's associated with a bot with um, sexy lo looking images and I yeah I I, I I stumbled again yeah so count count it as sin count it as a sin doesn't it anyway guys thanks again for watching and listening to this Bible reading video and my prayer video you know, in combination. I hope you are having a great day or a great night and stay tuned, stay faithful, remain steadfast and uh, let's hope that I will still see you guys in the next videos on YouTube. Maybe in the States, maybe also back in Australia, maybe in Europe. Bye bye. Take care.